it um, if it takes uh, if it takes annoying someone to raise a, a crucial issue, then that's my job, and I've got to do it. I've 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 only had one thing that was ever spiked, and it was a it was a column about Ramzan Kadyrov, the uh, Chechen warlord. Um, it was a nasty piece of work, let me tell you. So what I was suggesting is that I think at some point in the future, racing will, in order to sort of satisfy society's expectations of a sport that uses animals, have to restrict or get rid of the whip because society won't be willing to accept a sport which involves people hitting animals, whether or not it actually hurts them. Um, I didn't get any death threats, but I did get a couple of people who expressed a preference that I was dead, which um, is so, sort of a lack of commitment, actually, to, the, to their sort of opposition. Now, I understand that you've got a few opinions about bookmakers and bookmakers' behaviour in general, and you can really let us have it because we don't mind you giving bookmakers a hard time on, in these interviews. I don't think they're the total pariahs they're sometimes made out to be, but at the same time, I think that there's a, the, the sort of last decade or so has, has shown there's, there's a fair bit to be desired in the way some, some bookmakers have conducted themselves. 